Well, hello again, boys and girls. Guess who? It's me, Tater, your Milo Mustang. Have you been getting donations for Jump Rope for Heart? I really hope so, because Delilah is so ready to come and visit and kiss that cutie Coach Smith and the other coaches too. But today I'm here to talk to you about something you have heard a little bit about in the past, but will experience as fifth graders. That is called exhibition. All through your years here at Milam, you have learned a lot of things about attitudes and attributes. You have learned about different themes and answered questions about our IB topics like sharing the planet and how the world works, maybe even where we are in place and time and how we express or organize ourselves. You may have been asked some deep thinking questions or you may have asked some questions of your own. That's all part of the IB world that we belong to. I better put on my safety goggles for this. Now I feel safe. This leads me to the exhibition that fifth graders will be preparing for you. You have all worked very hard to get here, and this is the final step of your elementary IB years. Just to get you a little excited about this idea, I got dressed up for the occasion. Science totally makes me run around the field like a crazy horse. Do you like fossils and dinosaurs and rocks? So do I! You may remember that last year, the fifth graders had a trash and show and included many cool concepts about science. Maybe you learned some new words during that show. This year, the fifth graders want to continue with the science theme, but the teachers have come up with some super duper ideas. And now, the fifth graders have to get in teams, come up with ideas of their own, and make really spectacular projects and games that you may be able to participate in. In fact, I hope you do participate. Spiders! I love spiders too! Teachers and staff from across the school, all grade levels and all areas, will get to help out as mentors and help the groups along and create science games. High school students from Mackay will be coming over to help with technology and helping to produce some totally awesome iPad science apps. And most exciting of all is that you will be invited to attend the big convention, SciCon with the 5th graders and play the science games they create! The food chain. I'm naturally an herbivore, of course, but I'd like to be a carnivore. We only have two months to get ready for exhibition. You might see some 5th graders in your class and asking your teacher some questions or getting some help with their projects and designs. Please, please cooperate with your teachers. Everybody needs to help everybody and make this a successful event for fifth grade. And fifth graders, you will be respectful of the teachers that are helping you and mentoring you along the way. Trust me, if it all works out, we're going to have a great time playing at SciCon. Space! A flying spaceship horse is the coolest ever! One time, I took Mrs. Torres to see the planets and the stars and the solar system up close. Okay, I think you get the idea. At SciCon, the fifth graders will dress up as the game pieces to their science games. They will teach you how to play their board game and electronic versions. This is going to be so cool! You can help make exhibition of 2015 a major success? I can't hear you! Okay, good. Shh, shh, good. Because I have seen and heard a few things that really make me worried about you all helping out and pulling this off. You need to listen to your teachers, do your homework, study for STAR, 
don't get in trouble, and please, please take care of your teachers because they are trying hard to make you the best people you can be. Hey, speaking of that, which one of you fabulous fifth graders is going to bid to ride me at the Exhibition Reflection Parade in May? That's going to be so fun! Exhibition 2015 rocks! <laughs>